So, it's my dad's 60th birthday today. The old Kent. And it's party time. I've been fucking good the whole time I've been here in New Zealand. I've been here like four days, five days now. Um, I've had cardio every single morning, fasted. I've weight trained every night, as well as uh, 15 to 30 minutes cardio after my weight training session. So I don't know what happened, man. When I when I arrived in New Zealand, my motivation just went fucking through the roof, eh? Like, I think it's just a combination of not having to work, getting up in the morning without having to, you know, worry about work. You're just in a good mood, in a good headspace. First thing I want to do is go out for a walk, just to get my body moving and... Uh, yeah, get closer to my goals. So, motivation's not a problem. But today, I'm definitely drinking. There's no way around that. It's going to be the only time I probably drink this whole holiday. Um, so, yeah, can't wait for that. But first of all, I've got some stuff to do. I've got a bit of bit of a list here. I've got to cook my chicken for tomorrow on a hangover because I really can't be fucked otherwise. And I'm planning on just going as low carb and as low fat as possible and just having my protein tomorrow because obviously I'm I mean alcohol is just carbohydrates at the end of the day it's just sugar so depending on how much I have today is how my diet will go tomorrow but who cares I'm definitely drinking I'm not gonna sit there like a sad cunt um got to get my dad a present haven't fucking got that yet so that'll be my next task and also I need to buy some shoes because Stupidly, I only bought these ones, and <laughs> yeah, they only look good in the gym. So uh, yeah, that's it. And then I'm uploading a video as well. So I've uploaded, I've got a few videos to go um, that I shot just before I left Australia, because I obviously knew that I wouldn't have much uh, material to upload while I'm away. So yeah, I'll still I'll be uploading those every couple of days. Um, there's some music ones, as you might have seen which I hope, hope I can help people because I would have loved uh, to be to be told about royalty free music and copyright free music and um, what's available and what's not. Uh, I've been stung by copyright heaps of times and it's fucking annoying because you either have to take out just that part of the song in the, uh, in the video, which it does automatically, which means that if you're talking over it or anything, that's going to be muted as well. So it's you have to fucking redo the video, re-upload, it's, it's stupid. So it's much, much easier to make sure from the start that you're not um, infringing on any copyright uh, from people. So yeah, either way, I'm gonna go to the shopping mall. Always brings back good memories. And we'll see what I buy my dad, so I'll see you there. All right, so the first trip was completely unsuccessful no place to screen print the top which is what I want to do for my dad's birthday and I want to get a couple screen printed for me as well um, so fuck. detours man detours around Christchurch are ridiculous there's fucking one around every corner it seems the earthquakes happened five years ago and there's still road cones everywhere, like, it's ridiculous. But either way, I'll show you guys when I've got the finished product, and uh, hopefully it looks good. Alright guys, slight change of plan. Ended up buying about 500 bucks worth of shit for me, and about $20 worth of stuff for Dad. No, it wasn't that bad. But I, uh, I got him a. I didn't get him what I what I wanted to get because I couldn't get it screen. I couldn't get it printed in time. It's gonna be tomorrow. If I got it done today, the quality wasn't gonna be very good. So I thought, fuck that. Oops. And I didn't do it. But either way, I'm going back to Dad's now. Everyone's gonna be starting the party. And uh, so will I. <laughs> Alright guys, just pulling up at my dad's place. Here are some people. Fuck, there's people there already. Holy shit. 
All right, guys, before I get too drunk, you guys got to see this, man. There's some cars here, all right? Now, Dad likes his old American muscle cars, but have a look at some of these, man. It's crazy shit. Got about four Corvettes, one Ford Mustang, fucking two Cadillacs. This, people, is mine. Well, it's not mine, but it's the one that I drive. Fuck. Bruh. American muscle car. Don't do do what? That. <gasps> what the fuck are you doing? Okay. You are tripping Shh, out. Don't swear. I'm not tripping out, Homer. Oh, no. What is up everyone? It's Monday, the day after, party. Not really sure what footage I got actually, if any. Well, I'm sure you've just seen it, but um, fuck it was an awesome party man. Like, saw so many people I haven't seen for years and years and it was so funny because all the dad's old mates remember like, when we used to go on holidays and stuff, I was an absolute little asshole when I was a kid. So, they would bring up these fucking funny stories and, oh. Really good, really glad I came. The one person I do feel sorry for is my sister, because she's stuck back in Alice Springs and she would have loved to be there too, but couldn't afford it and I wasn't gonna shout her. So she's stuck back there. But anyways, let's be real here. How much did I drink? Um, fuck, I would have had to, I was having bourbon and Diet Coke the whole night, so no sugar from the Coke, but um, yeah, probably near on a bottle of bourbon a litre throughout the whole day so you know I didn't have any blackouts or anything that's something I fucking used to do all the time which has really really put me off drinking but uh, yeah so got through it unscathed I was up this morning up by 11 at the gym by 1 smashed some arms and chest uh, and tonight I've got a another dinner went out for Chinese the other night and basically, if, I go out, if I'm going out for dinner or having breakfast or something, I'll just fit it into my macros. I mean, you guys know how I do it. Um, you know how flexible I am. And um, I'm not going to say no to a family dinner, especially not when I'm on holiday. And that's what I've came for. So you definitely can work it into your diet, and that's what I've been doing. But every morning I've been doing cardio. I keep on top of that. Um, and 
summer evenings, well actually after every weight training workout, I've been doing cardio as well. That is a real, <laughs> that's, that's new for me. I, um, I've never done cardio in a treadmill up until this holiday, put it that way. So yeah, I've been doing half an hour post-workout and at least half an hour every morning. Uh, and fuck me, I'm happy with how I'm going. I mean, yeah, tomorrow I'll assess the damage because this morning I weighed, I weighed in at like 86.5 kgs, which is the last, and I weighed on that scale the day before on the Saturday on the exact same scale and I was like up at about 90 so that is how dramatic the um, dehydration can be after fucking drinking um, but yeah obviously tomorrow I'll have all the water back in me and I'll be up to a normal weight so we'll see what that is and um, hopefully I'll be able to get some workout footage because I'm feeling feeling like uh, it's time for a, another update in the gym so yeah anyways 40 days out as of today on Saturday it was six weeks out October 17th WBFF 2015 pro qualifier on the Gold Coast can't fucking wait <sighs> yep can't wait all right guys I'll leave you there I'm gonna keep walking for about half an hour get my steps up to over 10 minutes. And then we're going to have dinner and dessert. But staying within my macros, of course.